Hi, I'm uh, Jason Ross, and I, uh, I come at this from a very different approach. I'm, I'm not a politician, I'm not even a public speaker, I'm a programmer by trade. And, and uh, so what I do is I, I look at a problem and I try and break it down and figure out what the flaws are and, and how you fix it. And one of the things that I've discovered on this journey for this election is, is the electoral process itself is, is severely flawed. We were testing for the wrong thing. This type of meeting, uh, where we don't have the questions presented before us, we don't really have information to work off of, and, and we're told to respond in, in a short period of one minute. Um, we had two minutes for introduction, which is twice as much time as we get to talk about a specific issue. And, and that's not what the mayor or council does. Mayor and council, they get reports, they get information, they look over it, and they get a few days to actually consider it and re reflect and research. And then they come to council and then they discuss it. And there isn't discussion happening at these things. There's not careful thought. Um, I'm not an expert in any of the, well, most of the subject matter we're going to be talking about, unless we talk about IT, because, like I said, I'm a programmer. Um, and video, which I've got a camera, and I've been video recording these meetings because I think it's important that it shouldn't just be for the people who attend, it should be for everybody. If you want to go on, I want to see it. That you should be able to have that option. Um, so I'd like to take that approach to the way the city runs. I'd like to break down all the processes that we do. I'd like to break down the meetings of the council themselves because they're really stuffy and they're hard to follow and, and the council doesn't do a good job of inviting you in and, and prevent, providing you the information in the easily digestible form. I mean, if you want to be, if you want to pay attention to even one issue, you have to read dozens and dozens of pages and do lots of hard work and research do you even feel like you're part of the conversation? I think that should change. Right on. Uh, well, I, first I need to plug my website, moderndemocracy.ca, uh, and my YouTube channel is also Modern Democracy. You can also find me on Twitter at Jason Ross, uh, and I have a Facebook Modern Democracy page as well. Um, this has been a really odd educational experience for me, this whole process, and, and we're getting close to the finish of it, and, and it's, uh, obviously I, I have issues with speaking publicly and being clear sometimes, and, and I apologize uh, if I'm not doing that very well sometimes. It's, it's hard. It's, like I said, I'm not a public speaker. I'm, I'm, I'm just a guy who's passionate about his city and passionate about governments in general and liking to see a change. I, I, I want to see a different tone in the way a conversation takes. And, and uh, you know, I'm even uncomfortable with what I said to Dean earlier, and I do apologize, Dean. I, I, I get, I get, I get. I just want to see good governance and I want to see good conversation. And, and that's the most important thing. And, and if you don't want to vote for me, at least keep paying attention more. I mean, I wish this was the turnout at council every week, every week. I wish that we had people engaged and paying attention to what we're doing and actually, and I wish the information was out there in a way that it didn't require you so much time, so much effort to just get involved. I wish the buried entry was easier. And that's what I want to bring. Whether I get elected or not, that's what I'm focusing on. Using technology, using people, using people power to really change the way the city works. and and, and that will blossom out to other places as well. And that's my thing. <laughs> I had a trauma.